Hello, everyone. Today's episode will be a real roller coaster, so fasten your seatbelts. You won't believe the latest drama around Zach and Tori Roloff from the TV series Little People, Big World. Let's dive into it. So, Zach and Tori Roloff recently caused a lot of controversy with their comments on a very sensitive topic, abortion. They talked about their personal experiences and views on their podcast Raising Heights, and let's just say not everyone was happy about it. On the latest episode of Gaining Ground, Tori opened up about her experience with a miscarriage, which profoundly affected her views on abortion. She explained how losing her baby in 2021 made her question how anyone could voluntarily terminate a pregnancy. Zach supported her by criticizing those who don't want to deal with the consequences of an unwanted pregnancy. When Tori and Zach shared a snippet of this episode of the podcast on Instagram, they knew they were going to get a lot of reaction. And they were right. Some followers praised their honesty, but many others were quick to criticize their views as narrow-minded and privileged. Tori, recalling her miscarriage, said, before it happened, I was very apolitical. I thought, this is not what I would have chosen, but it's your business. But when I was in that room, traumatized, everything became black and white for me. I can't come to terms with it. I don't understand how anyone could choose to do this. Zach, who has a strong stance on the issue, is particularly concerned about people aborting children with conditions such as dwarfism. He stated, if I go out, have a beer, drive and get into an accident, I'm going to jail. This is a consequence. The choice to have sex, it was a choice. My God, this is such a polarizing topic. No wonder the comments section exploded. Some people even said they were done with the roll-offs for good. One Instagram user commented, just because you can't understand why someone made that choice doesn't mean you can take away someone's ability to make it. Another pointed out the privilege that Zach and Tori have. You have no idea what other women go through. To belittle it to something like them getting drunk and having fun, that's absolutely appalling. Despite the backlash, Tori is standing firm. In the following video, she emphasized, if you have a healthy baby and a healthy pregnancy, I think abortion is morally wrong. But there is a difference between the treatment I received after a miscarriage and abortion because you don't want to face the consequences of your actions. It's definitely a topic that gets people talking. What do you think? Should Zach and Tori have kept their opinions to themselves, or do you respect them for speaking the truth? Share your thoughts below. In another emotional segment, Tori spoke about her experience with miscarriage before welcoming their son, Josiah. She recalled how her pregnancy seemed to be running smoothly until her eight-week checkup, where she learned that her baby's heart had stopped three weeks earlier. I remember being angry at my body, says Tori. I had a miscarriage that didn't happen, meaning my body didn't realize the baby had died. So I had to decide how to move on with my life. She described how the ultrasound doctor comforted her during this difficult time by holding her hand and reminding her that everything has a purpose. Despite her heartbreak, Tori found comfort in her faith, believing that one day she would meet her baby. Tori also recalled that they did not announce her pregnancy with Josiah until she was halfway through, out of fear of experiencing another loss. Josiah was born in 2022, and Tori expressed how unimaginable life would have been without him. Isn't it amazing how resilient the human spirit can be? Tori's journey is a reminder of the strength we all have within. If you have been through something similar, know that you are not alone. Zach and Tori also discussed the frustration of having to share their personal stories on a reality show where the narrative is often compressed to fit into the episode structure. They felt that the show could not do justice to their experience of losing a child. This is our baby, said Zach. When you get pregnant, it's a child. Losing that baby was like losing a part of our family. Tori and Zach's surviving children, Jackson, Lila, and Josiah, are dwarfed, and the couple often express their gratitude for their 
perfect children. I can't look at my children and see anything but the grace of God and the love of Jesus in them," said Tori. They are miracles, blessings. What do you think of Zach and Tori's story? Do you find their honesty refreshing, or do you think they should be more careful what they say? Let's have a discussion in the comments. Alright, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed this deep dive into Roloff's latest drama, don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more celebrity news and updates. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Goodbye. Stay fabulous.